I'll be sharing a software which is less than one MB and I've been using it for years for capturing the screenshots and it's a very simple and basic tool. Uh, let me start with that. So the name of the tool is Capture. The full name of it is Chris Harlow's Quick Screenshot Utility and it's 330 KB only. So firstly, you have to click on it since I have already started it. So it is uh, giving me a warning. So then what you have to do is uh, for activating it, you have to press Alt F1. I have written the instruction as well. Like for example, Alt F1 to activate. So as soon as I activate it, it gives me a plus symbol by which I can, if I go to the first option, I can left and drag to capture so now whatever region i have captured it has uh, put it at one place for example here if i want to paste if i will paste you can see that i am only getting this portion and you can even paste it in a word document as well or email so it's very quick now coming to the other features of this the second feature is sometimes you want to put an arrow you want to highlight in a big screenshot again press alt f1 so now just hold the control key so that you can highlight some portion like this. So now once I'm done with the highlight again without pressing the control, I can select like this. So this is the second feature which is being highlighted here. Control plus left drag. Another is after pressing Alt F1, you can use the shift key. So if I press shift key, it allows me to draw ellip ellipse like this. And if I want to do freehand drawing, I can use right click. So I can use right click and I can highlight like this. And if you see that my screen is paused for the time I'm drawing this. And if you see the something on the right side yellow, so it is telling me that how this tool works. What I'm explaining to you, it's written over here. And after you are done with your selection, you can just select it out. And for example, if I'm in my email and here also it automatically gets copied in the on your clipboard, you just have to press control V and I have mentioned the link for this tool in the in the description and here also you can see bit.ly slash s capture. So hope you like the videos and you can subscribe to this and it's a very nice tool. I've been using it for more than six years and it's really useful. Thank you.